Alright guys, in this video, I'm going to be discussing all the new things coming in Gorilla Tag's Fall Update 2024. I'm going to be covering all the leaks slash sneak peeks that Gorilla Tag has sent out already on Instagram. So yeah, but without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so the countdown for the fall flashback has disappeared, and that's because they actually got the time wrong somehow. When the Monkey Blocks update came out, there was a timer for the flashback, and it ended on Tuesday. Unfortunately, they announced in the Discord it was a mistake, and the flashback will come in on Friday as well with the update. And it's also confirmed the turkey leg and all the other old cosmetics from fall are going to be coming back. So if you want to get some of the 2021 fall cosmetics, this is your time now. Another thing to expect in a new update is way more fall decorations. This monkey box update was kind of like a pre-fall update because as you can see, there's a little bit of fall decorations, not much though. For example, they have the corn crops that are not fully grown yet. They have pumpkins. And they also added pictures in basement related to fall as well, like this turkey right here. And whatever the hell this is. There's also more images in forests with new cosmetics as well. One of those images is a monkey right here at these double zones with a sticky hand. You can kind of like hit stuff with it and it'll stick onto it. If you've never had one of those in real life, they are extremely fun. So I'm very excited for that cosmetic to come out. The next image I'm going to be talking about, it takes place right here on this bridge. You can see a yellow monkey with a cheerleader costume on. But the interesting thing about this photo are the things on their fingers. I don't know what those are called, but you can also see some around their wrists. So maybe you can stick those onto things like yourself and other people. It kind of makes sense for you to be able to stick them onto things because it's on their fingers. It'd also be pretty cool if you like can grab them and throw them, it would stick onto things really far away. In the next image, you can see a blue monkey with a type of jacket on and a leaf blower cosmetic. Look closely, there's actually leaves flying away because of it. So maybe we'll be able to blow leaves away with the cosmetic. Okay, now for the final image. In this image, right here, you can actually see a machine called Beetle Bounce or something. I forgot what it was called. Alright, so I just double checked and yep, it's called Beetle Bounce. And you can also see the monkey holding a kind of controller in their hand, so maybe that's how you play it. Or it's just hinting on a new cosmetic that you'll be able to fly around like the dragon in the plane. You don't really get to see what the game is, but I might have an idea. I think it's based off of an old mobile game called Doodle Jump. Because if you think about it, Doodle Jump, Beetle Bounce, sounds the same pretty much. If you don't know what Doodle Jump is, you play as a little character, and you have to try to make your way as high as you can by bouncing on little platforms. It's a very simple but fun game, so you should definitely go try it out if you haven't. But I think that's what it'll be based off of. That was pretty much it for the video, guys. I just wanted to go over what's coming in the update and stuff. Thank you for watching. Comment down below what you're most excited about for the update. Me personally, I'm mostly excited about the decorations. And I want to see the new arcade machine that's coming out as well. Well, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.